Hi guys, today Sue and I are going to make board games for Move if you want to take part in it. <laughs> Paper? And what do you want me to do with it? For starters, a cube like this. Will you manage? I'm ready to follow each and every step of yours. We'll start with the outline and a cutout shape of the cube. Nothing complicated so far. Next, we'll cut everything out using a cutter or scissors, just following the lines. The main point here is to not get cut, guys, so feel free to ask for help. And after you're done, you should make two openings here and here. I think I've got it. We're gonna need to assemble the cube following the bends. Next, we'll just carefully glue everything up in order to get… One perfectly square awesome cube! Uh -huh. Or a bunch of them! <laughs> Whoa! I didn't know you could work that fast, Susie! There's a lot of stuff you don't know about me, Roger! <laughs> <laughs> that I don't doubt at all! However, I'm very much in the ball myself! Would you just look at this, guys? What does this look like? I bet we can all relate to tasty grilled s'mores! Uh, yeah, mm. yeah, we got it, Roger! Hey. Fine, I'll put the fire away. So, maybe you'll try to guess which board game are we making here? Let me think. Oh, the next piece! Is it the Happy Kebabs? If there is such a game at all. All we need to do now is attach everything to the base. Your turn, Rod. Hmm. What if I do this? Ah, that's why we didn't secure them with glue. Yep, the cubes have to be able to spin so that you and I could play. And this must be the lid. So, guys, have you already guessed what we are talking about here? I think I've got it! Spit it out! The guys and I are all ears! These are knots and crosses! Multiple use! Well, for you being such a smarty pants, I'll let you pick the design! Just remember you suggested that! Huh? Let me see <laughs> that! Okay. Hey! Oh, banana! <laughs> You'd better go to your place, buddy, until you've eaten all the bananas here! Called it, Susan! A yellow minion on a yellow background doesn't sound right! Well, well, I had him somewhere here… Aha! Uh -huh, there he is! Let's get to it, buddy! Now we're talking, we're one kind of a team, right? You don't <laughs> say! I just want to check. Here's an X and we have an O here. Well, Miss Susan, are you ready for a game? What should I be ready for? I'd already won! Hey! <laughs> let's make it right! That's better. So, one more time. Let's start already. Well, Roger, I guess this time your logic let you down, huh? <laughs> Not again. Ugh, what is wrong with me? But all right, we're about to face a speed challenge. Don't go anywhere. Okay, now it's my turn to teach you something. Choose. Uh, I wish I knew what these are for. Mm, let it be this color. And I'm going to take pink as a tribute to our slick slime pal. Only we don't need the whole paper sheet. Bam! Did you make it? Bam. Bam! Ugh, whatever, magician. I'll do it the old-fashioned way. Oh, are you ready, grumpy grandma? Watch closely. We'll make a few creases. Three, actually. And we should get this thing in the end. Okay, let me try this. At first, we should bend it in half uh -huh. like this. Now one more time like this. Not like that, huh? Sue. Try once more. Oh. And then we're making a little corner piece. So far, so good. Sue, give me those scissors you had earlier. There you go, Roger. Um, <laughs> thanks, prankster. Would you be so kind to cut this oh, off? Oh, you can never do without me, Raj, right? There you go. By the way, don't throw these away. Wait, wait, I think I got it. Now we'll just do this and… <laughs> no, you definitely don't do that. That is why you should never rush. Wow, let me see that. <laughs> cool. Oh, where did this come from? This must be a hint that it's time to make the runners. Hey, where are Ouch. you going? Give me my triangle back. Why don't you better draw the characters that will compete? In the meantime, I will guide the guys through each step of the technical part. Oh, cool. I have so many ideas already. We'll be back to Sue in a couple of seconds, but now check this out, folks. We need to fold the triangle like this to make something like a little pocket. And then it will be very easy to put it on our paper strip dash playing field. Wait, hold on, I didn't see that. I'll show it again. Not like this, and not like this. We do it this way. Carefully and slowly. <laughs> this is so cool, Raj. I hope you like this little one. Give me a runner, please. Look how cute this Bunza Bunny is. Give me that cutie back. 
Hey, this bunny looks great here. Which is good because our second runner will be Cadby. We'll just add some colors for him. He looks so great in this pink background. Well done, but I haven't been idling my thumbs either. Oh, let me see that. Oops, <laughs> you're from the next craft, fella. And this wonderful finish line goes right here. So, were you ready for the race, Susan? Wait a minute, just to make sure that you didn't cheat while I wasn't watching. Oh, please. On your marks, get set, go! Yeah, so my friend, it's a tie, 1-1! One, one. Well, congrats! This is for you, thanks for the race! That could mean only one thing. We need to make the third craft to decide who's the best! And then BAM! Uh, that's not quite how I imagined a paper race. So, should we begin with the matchbox gluing it around with colored paper? You're a fast learner! <laughs> I wonder why that surprises you so much. Don't forget about the small size of the box, Miss Smarty Pants! By the way, the guys and I outdid ourselves, we made four more! So, it means I'm gonna have to beat all of you in that race? Well, challenge accepted! Nurse, scalpel! There you go, Doc! The main thing here is not to rush. Everything is so small, it's easy to accidentally cut your fingers! And if we bend the upper part like this, we'll get an awesome windshield! So, what's next? <gasps> I know, the headlights! No car, not even a paper one, can do without wheels, right? Hmm, looks like I've made a slight mistake with the size. <laughs> well, we can easily fix that. Making a few paper wheels isn't too hard. And so that the work progresses faster, we'll work together. That's a great idea. It's like we're in a real car factory. Working as a one well-coordinated conveyor. Brrm. Look, we already have a whole car dealership here. Um, hello. I would like to buy a new ride. What do you suggest? Wow, guys, it's Sully from Monsters, Inc. Come on in, take a look. We have all the latest models. This one, it's definitely my color, but, uh, how should I sit in it? Roger, how could we forget about the seats? Calm down, Sue. I know what to do. There you go. It's a special order, especially for you. Shiver me chatters. Hey, now we're talking. I'll be back after a test drive. Phew, that was close. <laughs> Great idea with the seeds. And here's the last one. Thanks. It should go right here. <gasps> what? Did you hear that? It looks like Sully told all his friends about us. <laughs> That's okay. We have enough cars for everyone. Take your pick. Here you go, young lady. We're just gonna whiz, guys. <laughs> Let's go. It looks like our decisive race will gonna have to wait. Then why don't we recollect all of our crafts from today in the meantime? Hi guys, do you want to make some gifts for your friends? I do! For our friendship, I'm ready to do everything! What will we make first? Let's start from the trinket notepad. We'll cut out several sheets of paper with the size of 4 by 4 and a half centimeters. Be careful and make as many sheets as you want. Oh, I already can't wait to see the final result! Don't forget that the scissors are sharp, so you can ask an adult to help you! So I have a wonderful idea! I think nobody has ever thought about that! And I'm gonna need those pieces of paper! Here you go! Look! Holy cannoli, these hearts are so cute! I need them, Sam! Hey! Sam, be careful, please! And where is the foam paper? Are you talking about this? Exactly, thanks! <laughs> Let's make an outline and then we'll cut it out! Here we go, and… Great! Let's see! 
We have one pink and one blue hearts. Perfect combination. We need to make two openings. Sammy, watch this. Hey, let me see that closely. Hmm, aren't they too small to look through them? Those were not made for that. We need more openings here. Otherwise, we won't be able to get all of the sheets together. There we go. Hop. Don't forget that the cutter is very sharp. Yeah! Always look out for your fingers, people! And this is what we've got! Shiver me cheddars! It's time to combine them! You were right! Let's put everything together! Huh? Of course this won't hold up just like that! Are you sure, Sue? <laughs> and you just proved my point! We need a thread! I clearly remember that I put it somewhere here! Are you looking for this? Yes, thank you! Whoa! That was fun! Now we're gonna pull the thread through one opening and then through another. I wanna help, I wanna help! Sue, let me do something, please! Come on, Sammy, calm down. And now I suppose we're missing only one little thing. By the mozzarella, we should decorate it somehow! The notepads always have a picture on their cover! You're right, let's draw a face. Sammy, how do you like this cute little thing? It's so cool! I will write our stories in there! And the first one will start with Once Upon a Time, there lives Sammy and Sue, two very best friends! That's so sweet of you, Sammy! <laughs> hmm, where is my favorite book? Oh! Hey! Calm down, Sammy. Let's make BFF mugs from these. First of all, we should wipe the mug with a degreaser. Good. Sammy, are you okay? Ugh, where am I, Sue? Cut it out. Better draw something on the mug. Draw? Oh, okay. But what exactly, Sue? Don't hurry, just draw. Okay. I'm a great artist. Maybe one day my pictures will be in the loop. Sounds very inspiring. I think I'll draw something too. Wow, check this out! I can't even decide whose mug that one will be! By the way! I've also got something! Awesome! These two match perfectly! Where did you learn to draw like that? During my adventures in Tibidaba, I have many hidden talents! But now it's time for tea! I'm gonna choose this one, Sue! Okay, then this one is mine! There you are! Now let's make a couple of special plates for friends only! I see no place here! Where did you hide them? Ah, you're just joking with me! Chill out, Sammy. I didn't hide anything. We'll make the plates by ourselves. And we'll start from making kind of a pancake out of this. We should be very careful or our plates may just break if they are too thin. I still don't get it, Sue. Are you going to cook? I don't know that this is edible. <laughs> Sammy, no! Let's cook something later or we could just order pizza. But right now, let's cut out the shape of our future plates. Be careful with the cutter, guys! But I only see one of them! Am I not gonna have a plate? Did you forget your bestie? Please be patient, Sammy. Now check this out! We're gonna make two plates from this heart for both of us! Hup! Hup! And hop! See? It's one heart for two, just like our friendship. I think you should make some neat edges for those plates. And I'll just watch, because years in Jibitaba taught me that you can never know what to expect from clay. Holy cannoli, don't tell me that now we have to bake them in the oven. Sammy, you're so smart. Of course we should bake them. Just 30 minutes and everything's done. I hope you're ready for the next step. Let's decorate our plates a little. Ever. 
there. Once I saw such a thing in a dream. And I'm sure you were there also. <laughs> Are we done yet? Yes, Sammy. We're almost there. Just one more addition. And done. Snap. Oops. <laughs> one more. Awesome. It's the best place for my new trinket. This goes here. And a little bit of jewelry over here. Best friends forever. And nothing can change that. But it's still not the end, guys. Today, I'm your barista. And I've prepared a special drink for you. What a wonderful barista. But I still don't know how to put an inscription on top. I can help you. The main shape is done. Now we need a handle. So what are you writing there? Some letters? This describes our friendship. I'll give you one more hint. You. you love me? Of course I do, Sammy. Oh, so I love you too! Careful with the cutter! I won't need it, because I have magic. Wow, check this out! Let's test our new friendship charm. Check this out, Sammy. How do you like this? I am the biggest coffee lover now by the mozzarella. So can you make one more cup for me too? Sure, that's easy to repeat. Woohoo! Coffee time! Mmm, this defo looks delicious. Oh, my feta! It's terrible! Sammy, what happened? We totally forgot about Roger. He also needs a friendship charm. Hmm, I have an idea. We'll make a gift for Roger. Give me a second, I'll be right back. What, a gift? Check this out. Beautiful pictures, right? Yeah, but what are you gonna do with them? I can't give them as a gift to Roger. Watch and learn. When we finish, you'll understand everything. This is the first step. Be careful, the scissors are sharp. Sue, I've already cut out the second picture. <laughs> now we have two pieces for our t-shirt prints. We're gonna need plastic wrap, but I can't untangle it. Sammy, help me, please. No problem, Sue. There you go. Thanks, Sam. Uh, you're welcome. Next, we need more layers to do everything right. We will protect the picture with the plastic wrap. This way. I still don't get that. Won't it fall down eventually? Or should we maybe pin it? Have some patience. I'll show you craft magic. <laughs> no, the wrap just helps the picture stay on the t-shirt. While you were ironing, I did this! Look! Ugh. Oh, Roger is gonna love this! I want to present it to it myself! And right now! Oh, Sammy, you are so impatient! I wonder if Sue can see me. Easy, easy... Hey, Sam! Ugh, Sue, you scared me! Give me that! Chocolate to make more gifts! I know how to make them better. Let's make gift wraps for chocolate bars. First of all, let's remove this. Sue, I don't understand anything. We haven't started properly yet. I am all patience. Plus, I have more chocolate. I'm up! We have two drawings here. And markers will help make them more visible. Visible? You've drawn a ghost. I'm not sure that everybody loves them. I hope that won't stay black and white! Don't worry, we'll add bright colors. Shiver me cheddars! It will be the best gift for everybody! A chocolate bar and a yummy wrap! And here's the result. But I don't like the background. Much better! Now let's wrap our chocolate bars. Do you defo need double-sided scotch tape? Yes, it will help us a lot.
I love it. I'd be happy if somebody presented this to me. What if you had received two of them, Sue? <laughs> I would be twice as happy then. Now let's have a look at all of our crafts. 